Ashley's Pampered Paws is an authentic family business and that's how I'm gonna always keep it, you know? with Ashley's Pampered Paws. Hi, I am Haley Polhans and I'm uh, the Paws Perfectionist Director of Ashley's Pampered Paws. The reason I decided I wanted to do mobile grooming instead of a normal salon is because it's a different experience. You know, it's, it's in reference to boarding, right? It, everybody boards their dogs until they have dog sitters, people that come to your house because every dog's not the same. Some dogs do great in a grooming salon, never miss a beat. And some, it takes them three days to recover over it, like mine. And so for those people that their dogs have special needs or anxieties or they were rescues, we talk to them about that and we make sure that everyone's on the same page and knows what that dog's history is so that we can make sure they have the best experience. And that is the most rewarding part to me. Someone telling me, I've tried all the groomers all over the place and I just don't think there's any hope. And I say, just give us a chance. And they say it was the best experience they ever had because that rescue dog trusted us and that should tell everyone something. My favorite design is actually on the bus number two. I mean, it's my favorite with the original as well, but it's the back of the bus. Um, Cause it has my three babies on there, um, which was the heart of it all too. And um, the, the second bus, Ashley's Pampered Paws 2, has um, Bliss, who's the new addition to our family, and um, Samson, which um, is a very special story too. Um, really, it's that part, but it's, the Bible verse on the back that um, is my favorite because I just, uh, you know, the first time around that Bible verse was everything that I put on Facebook, everything I, I centered it around because I do believe that God establishes your plans. And um, when I called Michael to add it on last minute, I didn't even tell anybody about it, but I just felt like I've got to have that, you know, it's just, it's, and he was just like, I think it's awesome and I'll find a place and he found the perfect place. I think the wrap was such a key part of all of it because if you look at it, it re really and truly represents everything about pampering, you know, what we, what we offer and what we think of, little babies in a blanket all cuddled up getting a paw massage because you know that's what it's about so yes i think that when people see it they are able to see who we are and what we pride ourselves on and then they go to our website and it's the same thing it's important for everybody to know your story and what you stand for because then they can decide if you're the good if they're a good fit you know or if we're a good fit for them and not only that like you know I think not only do the customers love our service and what we provide for the dogs, but just to see this big, cute pink bus pull up. It makes you feel good. It, yeah, it always puts a smile on everybody's mm -hmm. face, whether you know I can be inside grooming and see people walking by and they're taking pictures. And it's sometimes like, is like, are they taking pictures of Ashley's or, or the bus? Because it's just, it is so uh, unique and cute. And it's just, it's something that, you know, you can look out your door and think, you know, that, that's adorable to see. <laughs> yeah, it makes that. people happy. You know, when you see things like that, it brings you joy. The, the vinyl on the bus, it just makes everything stand out. It pops, it catches people's eyes, it catches attention when you see this big pink, adorable bus driving down the road. Like, you're like, what, what is that? And um, it really just, and, in cases and shows, I don't think a paint job or anything would ever catch the attention like this wrap does, and it fully 
uh, covers everything from what we do. It shows our values. I feel like it shows our um, our genuine care and concern for the babies, the fur babies. Oh my gosh, it was quick. They had it done in eight days. Yeah, it. You would think how long it would take them to get a big bus wrapped, and it's not just like a, a sticker here, sticker mm -hmm. there. It's from the very top mm -hmm. of the bus to the very bottom of every the bus. Every square inch. Yeah, every <laughs> square inch. And it was done amazingly. Just, you can look at it and you can't even see if there's, you know, where they've cut around a door to make it fit better. Like you, you cannot tell because it's so well done and it just looks like one solid piece. I even, I've had people ask like, is that a vinyl? Because it's it's so well made, it's so the quality. It's is, very unique in my opinion scary. to any other rock that I've seen. And it was, a, we dropped it off, and <laughs> not even yeah, eight days later we we had yeah. it back, and it was perfect. All right, so um, the reason I decided to go with mobile instead of actually a salon is because I have three golden retrievers that are about. 350 pounds total, um, all three of them, and loading them up and taking them, it's difficult. And so they have brought so much to my life in the most difficult times that anytime I can bring anything good to their life extra, I do it. And um, so grooming is a part of that. They feel good, you know, they look good. It's the same as us, it's not much different. And um, they, I had had my Goldens groomed one time with mobile during COVID and it was great. One at a time, I mean the whole experience. Do you pay more? Yes, but it is so worth it on so many different levels. And um, I called to reschedule that appointment and I couldn't get in anywhere. I called five different places and I couldn't get in. And I thought to myself, I always wanted to have a business that I loved. Um, what I was doing because I do believe if you love what you're doing then you bring that to everyone around you It's been a long road and um, She I hate to say this out loud and I probably shouldn't but I didn't know anything about dog grooming whenever I started this company Nothing the only thing I knew is that I loved my dogs and I believe dogs save lives a hundred percent um they say, you know, they save you and not only save your life, but they're the constant source of love when you come home unconditional. and unconditional. And um, they're always happy to see you and they deserve the same thing. And um, so being able to to do that and know that these dogs are being taken care of the best way possible. That's why we do mobile. We don't want the masses. We don't want to overbook and see how many appointments that we can get. That's not what we're about. We're about the experience. I would rather have 50 clients that I know personally and I've talked to personally, which I have, most, almost all my clients I have. I would rather know everything about how Bentley and Susie are doing, you know, in their life than have some big business that I no longer knew those names whenever Haley and I were yeah. talking about how her day was and she was referencing dogs that have been with us since the beginning and tell me how great they are. That That is what we're about. Family. Having, um, starting with a client and the dog can be difficult at first but by groom four or five the dog, the clients tell you how much they can see a change in the dog from mobile to uh, salon and how much they appreciate it because their dog is happy and you know when they're happy everybody's happy and that's what we specialize in, in individual care per dog and it makes the it makes a world of a difference it does i think the best way that we can provide 100% satisfaction guarantee from all of our clients is giving them the information that they want to know ahead of time. Everyone does better if they know what to expect. Everything is about the initial setup. And so whenever we call and talk to our clients, we talk to them about everything to do with their babies. You know, whether they have four or they have one, we know their history, we know how old they are, 
Honestly, we know a whole lot more about them than that, but because we talk to them ahead of time and know that, then we can plan accordingly so that the next step, when Haley gets there or Alejandro or Kylie gets there, the client already knows what to expect. You know, they know the cost, they know what the services include, they know, you know, if they need a D-shed or what they can ask, and then, you know, they go, they go out to the bus, get taken care of from start to finish, come back up, take care of payment, and that's that. They know from the time that they talk to us exactly how it's going to go. And I think that's really the only way that everyone can be completely satisfied is setting the expectations of what to expect. You, you know, you can expect this from us and we deliver. And that's the most important thing to me. Ashley's Pampered Paws is an authentic family business. And that's how I'm going to always keep it, you know?